Hey guys, what's going on? This is Valiant, and today I have a Red Dead Redemption uh, gameplay commentary for you guys instead of a Call of Duty one. Um, this is kind of to uh, help out with leveling uh, online. And the main purpose of this video is kind of to um, give some tips uh, of the best way to do that. And then I am going to kind of share my first impressions. Um, you know, if it's a good game, bad, what I think about it. So, what you're seeing now is a free roam game. And in free roam, you can invite other players online to join your posse. And um, what we're doing right now, or what we are, yeah, what we're doing right now is uh, we're clearing a gang hideout. And in my opinion, this is the best way to gain experience and level up faster. So, ultimately, the quickest way to level up, in my opinion. And um, not only running through the uh, gang clear, but we're doing it over and over again. Because after you do that, you can click to replay it. And um, it's easy enough to just run through about six or seven of them and gain like five levels in ten minutes <laughs> or ten to fifteen minutes excuse me so what you really need to do um, is just get about a five man posse and you can run through um, the you can clear the gang hideout with no problem at all because a five man posse can pretty much control the whole free roam little lobby without any trouble because um, you can pretty much shut down any other posse in the game in the um, free room so fastest way to level up uh, go into free room and get a posse about four to five people um, I believe ours was five or four I'm s I can't really remember but do set a waypoint to a uh, gang hideout uh, preferably the closest one because you don't want to ride your horse um, across the whole map um, and then tell your teammates to go or your posse to go to the waypoint and from then on out you can just clear the gang hideout over and over again and I believe that I am level 12 I would want to say right now um, Actually, I'm, it's 12 to 15. I don't know. But in this uh, in this video, you see me get a couple of levels. And this is honestly the we easiest way to level up. Now, for my impressions of this game, I am loving it a lot. And it's just great to get a, a break from Modern Warfare 2 and just Call of Duty in general. Because Modern Warfare 2 frustrates, frustrates me more than any other game. And, um, you know, it's good to take a break. And the multiplayer, free roam, I love free roam so much. It's pretty much a playlist, you know, a lobby full of uh, people. And you can either posse up and fight the computer or fight each other. Either way, you will get experience to level up. And I, was, I started off playing the campaign, or sorry, I started off playing the multiplayer. Didn't really play the campaign. Um... And I was loving the multiplayer so much, I got hooked on. And finally, I decided to play the campaign, and I'm I'm loving the campaign. It's a uh, it's a very long campaign, so you can't beat it in a short amount of time, which I like because uh, it's very involved. There's so many different characters and different story paths you could choose. Um, you know, every move you make uh, adjusts the storyline or plot, and um, you know, I'm just having a whole lot of fun playing it. Now, for the campaign, I believe... Well, I think that this is Rockstar's best game that they have created. Uh, I do believe it's better than Grand Theft Auto. Some of you might um, disagree, but... R RDR or Grand Theft Auto GTA? What do you guys think? Leave a comment in the comments below. Um... And let me know what you guys think. But I do believe that uh, this game is a better 
better game overall. Now, overall, the the map and the uh, I love how in Free Realm you can go anywhere you want to in the uh, in the whole game. And multiplayer and campaign share the same map. And what I mean by map is if you go to your start menu and uh, click map, there's just this map of 1910 Western Western Territory, um, and you can go anywhere you want to when you're doing free room in that map. And you do have limited space, but it the space is it's huge. It's like uh, a state today um, that you can ride your horse all over. And um, the scenery is just amazing. Um, I love. Uh, it, it changes weather. Um, it goes from night to day. Um, you know, it's not just the same old boring map. So that is a ton of fun. And um, I look forward to, you know, getting to the end of the campaign because I honestly have no idea how it's going to be or how it's going to end up. Um, you guys can also leave a comment on what you think about that. And um, if you would like to see uh, more um, Red Dead Redemption gameplay, commentary um you can also leave a comment saying yes or no um no won't hurt me i know some of you guys sticking to call of duty but uh for my first impressions i was very impressed with this game but i immediately noticed that the movement was a little hard to control and it could frustrate you sometimes uh once you start playing but after the first few um hours of playing i've overcome the the movement and it's not affecting me at all really now but guys um yeah loving this game i would i would buy it or play it first somehow rent it maybe uh to see if you like it some might like it more than others uh you know that's how it is on every game so i can't just go tell you to buy it because i don't know how you guys are but anyway guys that pretty much concludes this commentary uh hope you and hope you enjoyed it um Check out my link in the description and come give me a visit. I have plenty of RDR commentaries on my channel. Alright guys, I'll see you later.